Well, the promotion tonight is purely a boxing promotion, but behind it is the Peacock Gymnasium, which um, started 1978 in a, an old, a disused room in a school in Drew Road in Silvertown. Um, we started there, got a few bits of equipment given to us by different people. Um, anyone was welcome, it cost them 50p to come in. Uh, and if they never had no money, they could put their UB, at the time, UB40s were everywhere. They could put their UB40 in the jar rather than their 50p. Um, we used to pay £10 a week, I think it was, for the room. And it just built on. People give us more equipment. We got more adventurous with it, entered events. We ended up in an amateur club, like loads of young kids there. And it continued to grow. I believe there was an impact on the community by the fact that the kids had somewhere to go, of all ages. And we'd have had kids as 11, 11, 12 year olds kids there, maybe some even younger. Yeah, some even younger. And then we'd have had 40, 50 year old adults there, all using the same, all using the same area. Well, today we're over 30 years on, um, and our membership has grown to something like 18,000, I think it's over 18,000 people have joined. Um, we have an academy here, which um, we have kids from all the local schools they come here, they, they take part in hairdressing, building, uh, bike maintenance, uh, acting, singing, dancing, and a wide range of other things. And, and also they take part in the actual boxing, which we teach them, and the weight training. So, And we've got people here who do kickboxing, karate, wrestling, professional boxing, amateur boxing. Um, white collar boxing, we have um, weight training, weight lifting, circuit training, keep uh, the list goes on. And people who just come in and enjoy and treat it as their own community centre. We used to, we've always got help from the community, especially the locals themselves. Um, over the years, the painting, the decorating, the wiring, all sorts of things has just been done by people. We haven't had to pay for it. Local people who are in them trades come in and they give the bit of help. Um, that continues today with, or it has continued with people who run the football clubs, people who run the amateur boxing clubs. So we're still getting support from the community. We enjoy putting promotions on. We have a bit of fun with it. Um, with the way the climate is with people with money at the moment, we don't put on as many as we would like to or we should do. We probably will do one amateur to uh, one or two amateur shows a year, um, three or four pro shows a year. But other than that, at the moment, that's how we see ourselves you know, going. We enjoy the sport. You never know. Tomorrow we may have a, a world beater here. And then that could take things in a different direction.